got it? All right. right. You got time, brother. How much you got? What's that? How much you got? got a few hundred at least. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> at least? At least, yeah, homie. Yeah, right. I'm smart, buddy. Brian, what do you think of Arrow's performance? Is this what you've seen in Spar? Yeah, I mean, impressive. I, I, didn't, I really didn't expect anything less. I mean, when you're going up against Jamel Charlo, and he spars with heavyweights on a regular basis, uh, I just think, you know, Ocampo was overmatched. Overmatched, and Arrow did what he was supposed to do. A world champion, you at home, you're fighting at home. You want to give the crowd something? What better way than give them a first round knockout? And from what you've seen with the crowd, do you think this could be a hot bed for boxing? Oh, absolutely. You know, Dallas, Dallas is Dallas is a good boxing town. You just need big fights here. Now you got a big time fighter. You're going to see this, I, I think, without question on an annual basis. Awesome. Thank you, bro. All right, cool. What's all tonight? Uh, no, you know, Errol was a huge favorite in the fight, so not too shocking that, you know, he would score the upset, or the knockdown, excuse me, knockout, but, you know, came quicker than probably some people expected. Did you think we were going to at least go four rounds tonight? Pardon? Did you think we were going to at least go about four rounds tonight? I thought a few rounds for sure, but, you know, you never know. What's the best welterweight match that can be made, in your opinion? Well, I think Errol's going to want to fight the winner of Garcia and Spence, or Garcia and um, Porter. And um, obviously Thurman needs to have a fight or two back before he can face him. And I think even though you know Crawford is a superb fighter, he just got up to welterweight. I think that fight is about a year away if they can make it, which hopefully they can. That would be a great match, but they both need maybe another fight or two before that. Uh, you can make a strong case for that. I mean, I you know I would think you know Thurman. We have to see Thurman get back and. And to the form he had before, stylistically, he and Spence would be a great fight. So um, we'll see. You think all those go through those? Uh, possibly, yeah, yeah. Excuse me. Hey, David. He's hot. Did you get to see Crawford's last fight? I did on ESPN Plus. Yes. Do you think him and Errol Spence would be a good fight? And they're both. Do you think they're improving? Oh, I think it'd be a great fight. Ter Terence Crawford does not have the resume at welterweight that Errol Spence has, but you know, against Jeff Horn, a fighter he was much better than. He looked good. Uh, he dominated the fight. And Terrence Crawford has a tremendous body of work under welterweight. So down the road, I don't think that's going to be in the near future, but down the road, that would be a tremendous matchup. Let, let, let Spence fight the winner of Porter Garcia first, then maybe Thurman. We'll see. Last question. Your network has been dominating with top-notch quality fights. What does it feel like just seeing the network get all these big fights? Mikey Easter, Spence. It's been as good a half year on Showtime as you ever have seen on any network, I think, any premium television network. This matchup was not among the best. We know that it was a mandatory, but every other matchup, I mean, Badu Jack and Stevenson, and, you know, Santa Cruz and Maris, and so many of the fights have been such quality matchups. And I think we're gonna get more. We got Mikey Garcia and Easter in, in a unification fight, which should be really good. So uh, they, they keep coming. Thank you for the great fight. My pleasure. Thank you. Be good. Hey, yo, Steve! Look it up! Hey, Gareth, man, y'all did y'all thing tonight, man. Coming down. No. There you go. Oh, okay. yeah. Let's get one with the trend here. It's my brother, man. It's inspiration. So it's good. Gotcha. Y'all ready now?
man, Gary James, the master. Oh yeah. Well, that's what I told him before we went out. I told him he hit him in the middle with the body shot. Beautiful stuff. Too good. Good job. <laughs> so why the fashion? You haven't officially met her. 